Hey guys, Kaya here. It's been a while. Um, I just wanted to talk about tech school and like first duty assignments because I have recently completed tech school and I am now on my first duty assignment. Um, uh, I don't know what that was. I went to Keesler for my uh, tech school. And Keesler is really nice. Like if you go there, you're you'll live in the triangle with the dorms, and uh, you have PT like three times a week, which in my opinion was a joke. Well, strength days were a joke in my squadron. Well, not even my squadron, my dorm. <laughs> there was just, it was bad, but running days are pretty good. Uh, tech school is is what you make of it, like. Yeah, you have restrictions and everything, but, like, on the weekends, you really don't, except, like, you have accountability before you get ATP and everything, which is, ATP is, like, advanced transition, so you kind of have more freedom and everything. You can leave with normal civilian, well, this isn't normal clothes, but civilian clothes and everything. Uh, school, for me, I thought was really hard, because it's so much information in such a short amount of time that it's like they squeeze so much into it and I'm like talking by my door and I hear people walking by and I know it probably sounds like I'm talking to myself so but um yeah like they squeeze so much information into such a short amount of time that you don't really get time to like take it in it's just like information overload and uh that was the most difficult part for me and I was just ready to be home, and I was kind of sick of tech school, and feeling like I was being told, like, I have all these responsibilities, yet being treated like a 12-year-old, you know? But what is? Kiesler wasn't that bad. Kiesler was pretty cool. Just don't go in the water if you go to Kiesler. The water is disgusting. I don't know why. I, just, I don't know why I went in the water. It's bad. Um, ah, peer pressure. Um, but yeah, so... You find out your first duty assignment, you can trade, you can swap. If someone offers you Europe, swap with them. Like, no questions asked. Just go. Just go. I had a chance to go to Germany, and I freaking didn't. And I'm overseas now, but I'm not in Germany. I said I went to Germany. I was talking to my German cousin. That sounds weird. I shouldn't say that. Last night, which caused me to, like, stay up late, which caused me to be really tired today at work. But that's relevant. Anyways... Uh, first duty assignments, when you first get there, it's, it's, it's like, you're excited, but you're nervous. Uh, you're gonna have a lot of training. You're gonna have to do, I just finished my CBTs, and I'm about to start my CDCs, if the program will stop acting up and, like, let me have access to them. Uh, which can take, for mine, up to four months, some people's can take a lot longer. Uh, or you could do them really fast and get them over with, so, you know. Which looks good. Helps you go BTZ, below the zone. Which, I volunteer a lot, you know. Once you're done with that. My supervisor won't let me take school and do all that until I'm done with them. But, like, uh, volunteer a lot. Like, I volunteered to be, like, a page or a prophet, whatever they call them. The commander's call the person that, like, stands up there and hands the awards to the commander in front of a big group of people. I really didn't volunteer for that, actually. I was voluntold to do that. So, yeah, that happens a lot in the military, by the way. You get voluntold, which is, like, basically forcing you to volunteer for something. Yeah. But, I mean, it was a good experience, so. Uh, I feel like this would be more organized, but it's kind of spread the moment thing. Um, I, I found a car today. Woo, that I'm finally going to get because I'm sick of walking everywhere and bumming people for rides. Uh, so, yeah, that's a good thing. It's really weird driving on the other side of the street. It's, it's not... It's weird. <laughs> and I keep... So, and I don't keep doing it. I did it, like, once. I turned on... Like, a lot of people do it, though. You turn on the windshield wipers because it's a turn sick, but it's not... And then the first, the very first time I was in my friend's car, who like left me this morning, I had to walk to work, I was pissed. But, I, I went out and I was on the wrong side of the road, like I was on the right side, like the American right, like, side I was supposed to be on, and it was not how, it was bad. And she started freaking out, and then I'm like, oh, and I, I hit, 
<laughs> I'm like gonna go so I go to turn and I turn on the windshield wipers and I'm on the wrong side of the street with them. It was bad. And it was, it was like starting to rain at that point. <laughs> it was just it was not a good experience. But uh yeah. So and gas overseas is freaking horrible. Like they're not even kidding when they're like, don't complain about this because overseas is ridiculous. Um work is stressful. I work in customer service, so I have to deal with people all day. Ew. But, yeah. Like, I, I dealt with people all the time in the movie theater, but then I was just rude to them because I really didn't care. I was like, whatever, I'm going to the Air Force, I don't care about this. <laughs> and I was just rude back, but here I can't really be like that, so it's like, ugh. But, um, I'm sounding like a horrible person. I'm not a horrible person. I just don't like dealing with people all the time but yeah so first do you decide I would show you my room but it's not totally clean like my room is never like messy because I'm not a messy person but my room isn't as clean as it should be just because I got back from work and I just kind of put my stuff down because I had a long day so tomorrow's a really long day I work like 12 hours that's gonna suck but what ifs what ifs well, I don't mean to ramble on. I don't know if this got you anywhere. Just, uh, what, what were the topics for this? Kiesler, or tech school in general. Study, 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 study. Just as long as you study, you'll be great. Uh, don't get involved in stupid crap. Don't drink if you're underage. Please don't. Don't sexually assault somebody, Sark. You'll get 50,000 briefings on, on Sark every day of your life. Not even when you're out of tech school. You will, I promise. In tech school. Just every day. <laughs> Drinking underage, you'll get that. I still can't drink underage, which I'm not really a drinker. So, drinker is not a word. But, uh, drinking age here, I'm still too young. Which, if I was in Europe, would not be a problem. Miss 18 here, but... Uh, that's probably a weird phase. You know what? You know what I noticed? All my... YouTube, all my, like, screen are, like, the weirdest faces. Like, I'm going to do something, and I promise it's going to be my screensaver. That's going to be my screens. I swear to you it will. YouTube always does that. They make me look... Anyways, you guys have a great... Whatever. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. I'm kind of just dark. I need to just go to bed, because I have a long day. So, peace. <laughs> Bye.